U.S. Senators Bob Corker and Chris Murphy introduced legislation Wednesday to raise the country's gas tax as a plan to save the Highway Trust Fund from drying up. This will raise enough money to fill the current gap and perhaps modestly, modestly increase our ability to make some long overdue infrastructure investments over the next decade. If something's important enough to have, it's important enough to pay for it. The bipartisan legislation would raise the gas tax by six cents in 2014 and then another six cents in 2015 to make up for inflation over the past 20 years. The Highway Trust Fund, which funds infrastructure in the U.S., is set to run out of money by the end of this summer. The buying power of the gasoline tax at that time, at today, is 63 percent of what it was at that time. Should the Highway Trust Fund run out of money this summer, it would put approximately 660,000 jobs in jeopardy. They say Congress shouldn't just put another Band-Aid over the problem. It's time for long-term solutions. Thousands of road projects stop work all across the country this summer, and the solution shouldn't be to just punt again. The senators are taking a realistic approach to their plan, calling out for their colleagues on the Hill to show the courage to back it. I know that we're not going to pass this in the next month. Uh, it's unfortunate. Uh, we're hopeful that over the course of the summer, we'll have the uh, corresponding political courage amongst our colleagues to work with us to try to get a real solution to this problem uh, in the long run. They expect their plan to be added into a Senate Finance Committee bill later this year. For WashingtonExaminer.com, I'm Lisa Rule.